The Nigerian Shippers Council, NSC, has expressed deepened commitment to the actualization of the ceiling project in the country. Mr. Emmanuel Jimmy, NSC's executive secretary, said this when the chairperson ceiling transnational company, Mrs. Dabni Shahoma, led a team to visit him in Abuja. According to Jimmy, the NSC has a mandate to protect shippers and ensure their ease of doing business in the country. He therefore said the council would do all that was necessary to support the committee responsible for realizing the C-Link project. Jimmy explained that the C-Link was an initiative put in place to bridge the infrastructure gap in the nation's maritime domain. There is no way that any nation can be uh, effective in its trade unless and until there is connectivity. And, uh, in connectivity, here we're talking particularly the waterways that we have. I have to commend the vision of those who set up this initiative. And I believe, you know, uh, again, Madam Tesla for that. So, when you ask me for partnership and support by way of advocacy, you're pretty much just singing to the choir. Mm -hmm. uh, that is our responsibility here, uh, particularly at the Shippers Council. Uh, and this has to do, I believe, with uh, the fact that as the mandate of the council is essentially to uh, protect the you know, shippers, uh, that we are also in a position to engage in the kind of advocacy uh, that ultimately is to their benefit. You know, so just take it as a given, you know, that advocacy is what we are going to do in partnership, of course, uh, with you. On the African continental free trade area, Jimmy said to efficiently participate in the platform, Nigeria needs to develop infrastructure that would respond to that emerging situation. I believe C-Link really has uh, a strategic you know, place uh, as far as uh, the development of our trade uh, facilitating is concerned. Uh, promotion of inland waterway operations for bulk uh, commodities, uh, so that's it was trade diversification of the Nigerian economy. These are uh, very, very laudable objectives of the ceiling uh, project. Movement of cargo is actually core and central to whatever I said that we want to do uh, as far as our mandate is concerned. So anything that really is able to engender uh, and to enable the environment so that uh, Nigerian shippers are able you know, to take uh, advantage of uh, uh, this evolving uh, uh, trade, trade, trade environment that is evolving. Um, I think that we have a duty you know, as Super Council to fully, fully get engaged and participate in the process. So not only are we going to be partners with you, uh, I'm talking next in here, uh, believe me, from now going forward, uh, if there's anything and any, 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 any effort that needs to be put in place that requires the Shippers Council's presence, ma'am, please take it for granted that I <laughs> Earlier, the managing director of Nextem Bank, represented by his technical advisor, Mr. Hope Yongo, also expressed the bank's commitment to the project. Nextem remains committed uh, to the project and to ensure that uh, we expand the Nigerian export basket uh, to make sure that being the dominant economy in Africa, we really take our pride of place. Mm as a major and strong trading partner. Mm -hmm. That can only happen with connectivity. Mm -hmm. uh, we need the support of the transportation uh, sector to really not take the lead. And that's why we are here, uh, asking for uh, joint advocates. And we are, we are mindful and hopeful that we should truly launch seedling official for both continental and inland waterway by June. That's the target we have set up for ourselves. Mm -hmm. We have been talking, like she said, we have been talking to three shipyards. Mm -hmm. One in Shipland, uh, Finland, one in Norway, mm -hmm. and one in China. Mm -hmm. They are all willing to provide all the crafts. We have been talking to the export credit agency. Mm -hmm. So those, those vessels are going to come in the uh, credit structuring that we have already undertaken and have negotiated upon. Mm -hmm. So just to just 
uh, tell this guardian that we want to deepen and broaden Nigerian exports. On her part, Shao Homa said the committee was in partnership with several stakeholders to ensure the realization of the project. There is no MOU we have signed in the past that Shepherd's Council has not been present. What we want now is for you to be actively involved. 